guys, it's me, Chipmunk. So, <clears throat> today's video is going to be about two of my favorite teachers. And today was actually Bring Your Child to Work Day. There were so many cute children. Unbelievable. Like, oh, they were all so cute. They're all so cute when I don't have to watch them. I even, I even made a little monster friend, and he's like a little monster football player, and he's so cute. His name's Oswald. But anyway, so my two favorite teachers. Well, I have had many favorite teachers over these my lifetime, but these are my two favorite male teachers I've had in school. Because as you know, as I was going in one of my videos I'll make later on about my ballet teacher, um, he was also my favorite teacher. So my two favorite teachers, one's a history teacher and one's an art teacher. And I actually was joking around with him today with both. I actually took my history teacher's picture because I do like this little column and he was the teacher feature. And it's basically where I interview these teachers about, so it's like a little get me to know me thing in school. So my history teacher, I love him. Like he is great. Mr. P, I'll call him. So Mr. P, he just got engaged. So happy for him. He's like 34. He's really young. And one of the funniest stories he's ever told me is he's like, I just moved into my new apartment and I have to go be the old man. This is like my first day. And there's these like loud young kids upstairs. There's these loud kids upstairs. You want to know how old these kids were? They were 20. Like, Mr. P, no, you are like 34. You're not that old. You're older than them. So, he also just got engaged, which I'm so happy for him. He's one of the most down to earth. I got my Starbucks. Um, it's a caramel macchiato. Um, one of the most down to earth people I'll ever meet. Him and the other teacher. I love talking to both of them. They're both fun to talk to about different things. So my next teacher is Mr. M. And Mr. M is an art teacher. He honestly, if he were to get fired, there would be a riot in school. Um, actually, I met up with him and I was joking with him. I'm like, oh, I'll meet you at Starbucks because he me and him both get like similar orders. So I'm like, oh, I'll meet you at Starbucks. He's like, I actually might. So um, I didn't meet him, I wish. But he was like, oh, I wish I could drive you so you don't have to walk that far, but I can't. Um, I can talk to them about both deep conversations. So one thing Mr. M is, is he doesn't care who you are. You could be gay, you could be trans, you could be straight, you could be black, you could be black, white, you could be anything. He doesn't care. He treats you just the way you are. And um, he doesn't care. He'll talk to you about anything. He doesn't care if it's about art or if it's about science. He wants to see you thrive in what you are passionate about. So if you're not passionate about art like he is, he doesn't care. He'll talk to you about neuroscience if you want. He is just honestly one of the best men. He's one of the best men I've ever met in my life. And actually, um, <laughs> I drew on myself. We have Prisma. I can't even get it fully in shot. Prisma markers? Okay. And um, these are all the colors. I like carmine and then red and then I like ultraviolet blue or ultramarine marine blue, blue, something like that. But Mr. P and Mr. M, they have a lot more in common than you they think they do because they're both, they both love drawing comics. They both wanted to draw comics growing up. And um, Mr. P is a history teacher now. He and Mr. M is an art teacher. Mr. M actually is teaching kids now how to draw comic books. And um, <clears throat> they both are into superhero movies. They're both really young. Mr. P's like four years older than Mr. M. That's it. They're honestly, they if they were to meet each other, they'd be best friends. These are like great people. Two great people I am going to keep in touch with when I'm out of school because I can't probably function without them because they're just great down to earth people I can talk to. So comment down below if you have ever had a teacher like Mr. M or Mr. P. And also, please like, comment, and subscribe. 
And if you want, you can hit the notification bell that will update you on when I post videos. I try and post videos every Wednesday. I haven't been as good because school's winding down. I'm Chipmunk, and stay true to who you are. Bye!